What's up, y'all? <clears throat> it's me. Back for a minute. Just thought I'd give y'all an update on the tank. Um, as you can see, I've gotten rid of pretty much every everything in there. Um, Alright, so let me give y'all a rundown. So, um, I've decided to stay with the uh, Severums here. I got four of them in there. Um, I've gotten rid of the Devil, the Black Belts, the Bandits, um, the Green Terror, and um, yeah, pretty much all the super aggressive Central American cichlids are out of there. Um, as you can see, my parrotfish is not here. That's because the Red Devil killed them. That was my last draw with taking those aggressive guys out. Um, they pretty much killed all my Africans, everything, and they were starting to beat on my Severums as well. So I decided to move on from them, get rid of them, and try a different approach. So what I did was I kept this selective fish here. Um, so these four guys were originally in there. I originally had five, but the other one was killed also. And the jewel cichlids are still in here. All right. And what I did was is I added my originally three blue acaras, but um, they, these two paired off and killed the other one within a day. So that's what it is. It's going to be just those two blue acaras in there, which these guys are beautiful beautiful very peaceful tank now um the only fighting is these four guys they don't really fight they just lip lock and they go about their business so yeah um what i'm also planning on doing is when my bashirs or birchers however you guys want to pronounce it when they're big enough they'll be added to this tank too and I'll be providing them some type of cover, maybe in these corners here with two big slate rocks that are in the stash right now. So at the moment, this is what it is and this is how it's gonna stay. Um, yeah, so over here you can see these guys, that's their, they're paired off also. So these two are a pair and those two are a pair. And um, this here, from here, from this end to about right here, is these two guys. That's their little domain right there. And then over here, as you can see, how they uh, scooped up the sand and threw it in the corner. That's these two guys. So, yeah. And um, that over there, this little area, would be these guys and you know up there is one jewel cichlid and this guy just roams around the tank so yeah that's what that tank is moving on um I know you guys been wondering what's going on with Larry so we're gonna go over here see what's up with Larry and there he is Big boy, big boys. This is the 120, nothing has changed in here. Everything's still the same, stocking, filtration, lighting, everything. Um, this is a $20 Walmart light and it works beautifully. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, I pretty much moved that to the corner to give Larry some room as well as the koi. The angel's getting big. He's quite, quite sized. And um, yeah, everybody's doing well in here. So there's not much to update about this tank. I'm gonna give you guys a little, a little shot of the full tank here. And um, let you guys see the fish up close. 
Larry's been spazzing lately, so I don't want to get too close to him, but amazing. There's Killer. Killer, Killer, Killer Dilla. Boy. There's Angel the Koi. The white one. My daughter has named him Angel. Along with him is Angel. <laughs> you got the the Ballad Sharks, the Bronze Koi, Goldfish, Silver Dallas, um, Longfin, Butterfly. Um, still got the little guys. Yeah, so that's pretty much that tank. And then we got this guy over here. These are the babies, which there's only a few of them left because uh, Big Yellow back there, he's a meanie and he's killing everybody. So, but pretty much what I did was rescape this to give them more hiding space as well as open tank to swim. And yeah, there's not much to go off of here, but I wanted a natural kind of look, you know, uh, trees, wood, greenery. I know the, the gravel is, you know, whatever. It is what it is with that, but um, I think for the most part it looks good. But yeah, anyway, guys, those are the, uh, the three main tanks. And just wanted to give you guys an update. So, I must step back, give you guys a shot of the tanks. And, you know, like, comment, subscribe. Give me some ideas if you think I should do something here. Um, besides the birches, something that they'll get along. But as far as... I'm concerned that's pretty much where I'm going to stop it at is adding the birches. See these guys, they uh, they team up, they, they, they do that like literally all day. And then they'll go away, go to their side of the tank, come back. Um, it's pretty funny. So that's how I know they paired off because these two don't fight. And those two don't fight, but they size up each other. Try to back each other down in twos. Yeah, um, so that's pretty much it. There's Larry, has a shot at this. Like, comment, subscribe. Hope you guys enjoyed. Just wanted to drop a qu quick video, let y'all know I'm still around. I'm still hobbying. So, yeah, I'll let your boy. Peace.